Hello, everybody. Greetings and salutations. It is Wednesday, which means the week is almost over and we're getting ready for that weekend. Hey, let me know when you're in the room. Send me a little massage. Hey, what's up, Jay? How are you? Good to see you. How's your week treating you? Hope it's treating you well. Let me see how this camera angle looks. Hey, you can't see me. All right, good. So, we have nine days left on the Lady Death Majestic Kickstarter. Still some editions available. There is also an exclusive comic book. If you'd like to back the campaign, but say a statue just isn't your thing, there is a comic book, Lady Death Majestic Number 1, Premier Edition. Uh, that is available for $25. Just go to the Kickstarter Lady Death sta uh, Majestic Statue, uh, and that is where you can find that comic if you want to support it. Hello, Lady Death Universe, also known as The Mighty Jimmy. How are you today? All right, so just want to see if I can hopefully get someone on with me today. Dog and Pony Show. Well, you'll impress them because you're an impressive kind of guy, Jay. Don't you worry about that. But it always makes you nervous when the big bosses come in, huh? It sucks. <laughs> Anywho, um, real quick, I got some fun stuff for you guys. Um, for those who are still commenting on the Facebooks and other social media, they are still, still packing and shipping the Lady Death Cataclysmic Majesty Kickstarter. So you're starting to see the photos. Don't worry, they're getting to you. They're cranking it out. It's a lot of orders for them to go through, but they're doing a heck of a job trying to get everything out to you in a timely manner. So give them some time. At least uh, reach out to us at inquiries at coffincomics.com if you haven't received anything by July 5th um, after the 4th of July weekend. It is a three-day weekend, so that might affect some shipping, but who knows? But if it does, please reach out to us again at inquiries at coffincomics.com. All right, so I got some fun stuff for you guys today. For all you metallic card fans out there, got some more metallic cards. Now, uh, a lot of these will be the last ones, and some of them are things that I don't think we've offered before. I could be wrong, but I think you're gonna like uh, what I have for you. Check my time. Oh, cool, still got plenty of time. Also, um, really big shout out to all those sharing their uh, packages as they're uh, showing off their uh, mystery envelopes and all the other cool stuff they got in. Definitely keep sharing those. Um, it's always great to see. And um, it's great to share this amazing community that we have here over at the Sworn Nation, Lady Death Universe, and all the other uh, great groups that we have that focus on all things Lady Death, Brian Polito Creations, and Coffin Comics. So special shout out to all of you. Well, real quick, um, I want to say that um, I really, really am grateful to be here with you guys today. Um, it's a little warm in here, but we got some rain. It's beautiful out. Too bad it's not so beautiful in here, but I'm here to entertain you. I'm here to show you some really beautiful things, and hopefully I'll get one of you on camera so I can do a nice little uh, interview with you and uh, get to know you a little better. All right, so let's get things going here on the catacombs. Let's show off some of these metal cards I have for you guys today. Now this one I have about, see my notes, I have 10 of these available right now. This is La Muerta. This is the Gomez metallic card. Let's see how this looks on camera. I have 10 of these available. These were offered at Fiend Fest uh, wow, two years ago. I can't believe it's been almost two and a half years now. So these were available at Fiend Fest and they are now available here in the store. These are the last 10 copies I have for you today. Next up, this is the last metallic card for this one. Let me get it. Come on, come on, come on. Difficulties. <laughs> this is La Muerta metallic card. This is the versus card. I only have the one available. Looks like there was 66 serial numbers. And this is number 59. Last one. 
One and done. All right. Another item that was available at FanFest. This is the Mike DeBalfo Instant Edition. Really beautiful card. This was really cool to watch because um, we had all the other artists contribute to this piece of work for the Instant Edition that year. Um, we had someone um, do the capes, the clothing, the hair, everything. So. You had a lot of people that contributed to this P work, so it's a nice little collaboration of majority of the artists that were there at Bean Fest. I only have one left, unfortunately. All right, let's see if you have any comments for both. Whew. Thank you. Hey, Jessica Hartman, how are you? Good to see you. How's your day treating you today? And yes, metallic cards. Woo! We got them today. Had some on Monday's show as well. All right, next up. So the last two for La Muerta. This is the Cemetery Metallic Card. Good. It's always good to be alive and well. If you were messaging me and you weren't alive and well, I'd be wondering what the heck is going on. I'm getting messages from the great beyond from Jessica. <laughs> well, I'm glad I can feed your addiction. I think the Metallic Cards are really neat. Neat! Piece of merchandise that we... Uh, produce here uh, for you folks uh, to pick up. All right, next up, this one is La Muerta, La Muerta Metal Card. Yes, La Muerta is everything. So I got a lot of La Muerta stuff today, Jay, and Thank you everyone who backed the uh, La Muerta Kickstarter that closed a couple weeks ago. God, was it already been a couple weeks? Jimmy Cricket. Eric Hart, how are you? It's good to see you today, man. How's your day treating you? I hope it's treating you well. All right, next up. This is, again, another item we had at Fiend Fest. This is Lady Death Metal Card Sworn. Yeah, this is a very iconic image by David Harrigan. This is a stunning, stunning piece, very popular. These are the last cards I have available here on the catacombs. Go ahead and Jimmy put in the link. Um, if you notice, I don't have links in the description anymore because um, Facebook was blocking it and I was unable to go live, so we solved that problem. So Jimmy will be posting uh, the links throughout the comment section so you can jump on. And of course, Anybody out there, I know you guys have always shared the links for those who are new to the show and are having problems to link to it. Thank you guys for sharing the links to make it easier for everyone to find what they're looking for. All right, another metallic card. This is the last one I have for this one. This is Lady Death metallic card Chrome. David Harrigan again, very beautiful, stunning work of art. This is my last metallic card. This is number 109 out of 166. This is the last one. Do, do, do. See right there, Jimmy's on top of it. Boom, thank you, Jimmy. It's always great to have a nice partner in crime here while we're doing these shows for you. All right, this is a very popular one, and it is signed by Brian. This is Death From Above. I only have the one available. This is the bomber cover. Bummer, bummer. It's a bummer if you miss out on the bummer. <laughs> this one is signed. It already has the COA. It is number 70 out of 99. Bing, bang, walla walla, bing, bang. Oh, that's the blank one. All right. And Dakota found uh, these two uh, and thought they would be great for the catacombs. These are the last two copies of Hell Witch. Hellbore number one. This is the metallic jeweled edition, and these are the last two copies. Let me put that down. I put a board in between these so it doesn't damage up uh, the backs of any other books or anything else I have for you guys today. So that's why you, you see me pick some up, and there's a blank thing. Well, it's to protect the uh, board on the other side. I do try to make sure I set some time aside so I can get everything rebagged and boarded, um, just so they look nicer when they ship out to you. Last two. One and a two. And then, bye-bye. All right. Next up, I have another 
last two of this, and this is a two book set. This is, here's my notes, this is Lady Death, Killers, Necromancer A and B. This is a two book set I have for you. These are the last two. This is a Warehouse Finds. Thank you very much, Dakota, for finding these. This is uh, set number 64 and six, set, sex, set number 66. <laughs> Hi, Leona, how are you today? Hope you are doing well. It's always good to see you on here. Thank you, everybody. All right, I got a scratch and dip for you all. This is La Muerta Lives, hardcover, volume one, scratch and dent. I only have the one, and I believe I have it going for $17. Nice scratch and dent, hardcover edition. This collects the first three chapters of La Muerta. So chapters one, two, and three are in this hardcover edition. Scoop it up before it's gone. All right, here we are. This is Lady Death, Judgment War, Instant Edition, number three edition. It's the only one I have, of course, because it's number three. It does have a little bit of some dingy on the cover on the back, so I went ahead and lowered the price, so this is technically a scratch and dent. It is $70. It has been marked down from its original pricing. All right, and found four more of this classic for all you La Muerta fans out there. This is the first metallic cover I ever saw, as well as the first imagery of La Muerta. This is La Muerta Descent Luxury Edition. I have four copies available, and these are a catacomb special. $60 for these four editions. Get them while you can. I've got four, and I'll have four of the Chrome editions coming to you guys on Monday. I have some of those as well. And that's the items I have for you today. Lots of metallic cards, some La Muerta luxury metallic covers. This is from the first La Muerta Kickstarter. I have a, um, a lower price number three in instant edition. The last two of the Harrigan two book set, the Necromancer. Last two of the Hell Witch Metallic Jeweled Edition, and I also have a Scratch and Dent La Muerta Lives Volume 1 hardcover, as well as tons of really beautiful, beautiful metallic cards for you guys today. All right, let's see if I can get anyone. Uh, if anyone would like to appear uh, with me here on the show, do a fun little QOA and something I like to let's get to know you, um, please, please. Uh, go ahead and type in sworn in the comment section and I will try to bring you up on camera and we can uh, do a little uh, get to know you, find out what's your favorite character, who is your favorite artist, all that other fun things and what brought you here to Coffin Comics. So if I can get a sworn in the comment section, um, I understand some of y'all might be at work, um, so I get if you can't get on because you know no one wants to get in trouble. Um, so the first sworn on here in the comic section if anyone's able to I would love to bring you on and get to know you um, some other fun things we've got coming up uh, next month there will be a special uh, online con we'll be doing so stay tuned for that also sign up for the VIPs newsletter so we'll be in the know or at least you will be in the know of everything happening here at Coffin Comics will it be uh, new productions uh, product we just uploaded on the store, interviews with our artists, and also just really great information on all things Coffin Comics. Um, it's, it's a really informative way to be on top of it. So sign up for the VIP newsletter. Um, it's real easy to do, and it'll keep you up to date on all things happening Coffin Comics. Also, I want to give a nice shout out to all of the people here at the Sworn Nation um, I've gotten so many friend requests uh, from you all. Um, please keep them coming. Also, if you have any wish lists for me, please send it to inquiries at coffincomics.com. All right, I got Ace. Ace, I'm going to put you on camera. Ace was one of the first ones I ever put on camera back in the day. So I am looking forward to bringing him on. There 
There we go. Ace. Add. All right. Here we go. Here we go. All right. Oh, what? You declined me? I want to try one more time. Ace, are you able to get on? Give me another sworn if you are. Definitely like to introduce you to everyone. It's kind of fun. Okay. <laughs> I saw the sworn. Okay. I don't want to get you in trouble, Doug. That's quite all right. It's quite all right. So it looks like everyone's at work today, which I totally get. It's great that everything's open up. Everyone's going back to work. Kids are going back to school. Things are finally coming back to normal. I just have to say 2021 is way better than 2020. And 2022 is going to be even better because we got Swarm Fest coming your way February. Start the year off right 2022 by picking up Swarm Fest tickets, $40 for the whole weekend. That is a screaming deal. You'll be able to meet up with all the Swarm, the Fiends, all the other amazing fans, all the amazing artists. I'll be there. Jimmy will be there. Brandy will be there. We're all going to be there. And it's going to be an amazing time. I really suggest you all come out and join us. So I'm going to wrap it up. I got to take care of a bunch of work today. But I just want to say thank you, everyone, for joining me today. I'm sworn to you. I'm Julian the Hooligan. I'm sure I'll be seeing you soon, possibly later on today, maybe even tomorrow. Either way, everyone have an amazing day. I'll talk to you later. I'm out. Oh, we're getting rain too, Ace. Yay, rain. <laughs> Talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.